This is the code July 2022 General Mathematics Paper 2 and we are answering question number 11 B and the question says the gradient at any point x comma y on a curve is given by dy by dx equals to 2 into x minus 1. So this is the derivative of the curve y. So the question says if a point 4 comma 5 lies on the curve, this is just one point on the curve, the question asked is to find the equation of the curve that is find y so let's attempt to answer this very question together so going back to the question we have the derivative of the curve and the, that derivative is now 2 into x minus 1 it is the curve that we wanted to find so now reverse this differentiation the reverse of differentiation is nothing but the integral so the curve y will now be equals to the integral of this derivative so integral of dy dx is now nothing but integral of 2 into x minus 1 with respect to x. It is this that we like to expand and find the integral term by term. So expanding the bracket, you now have 2 times x, 2 times minus 1. That gives you 2x minus 2. So you have to find the integral term by term. Integral of 2x will now be x squared. Similarly, integral of minus 2, 2 will now be minus 2x, then plus the constant of integration. So you now make use of this as a sample value of x and y that happens to lie on the curve y to find this constant of integration. So substituting x by 4 and y by 5 in this function y equals to x squared minus 2x plus c it will enable us to find the constant of integration, which is this letter C. So if you now substitute x by 4, y by 5 in here, you now have 5 equals to, in place of y, you now put 5 there, because this is y equals to x squared minus 2x plus c. So you have 5 equals to, for x squared, you replace the x by 4, so you now have 4 squared. Minus 2 times x, you now have 2 times 4, then plus the c that you wanted to find. So simplifying this, 4 squared will be 16. 2 times 4 will be 8, so you have 16 minus 8. So you now have 5 equals to 16 minus 8 plus C. So collecting the like times 16 minus 8 gives answer 8. And when you now take 8 to the left hand side, you have 5 minus 8. In the end, you now have C equals to minus 30. So this is now the constant of this integration. So you can now write the exact function y because you have the value of c. So you now go back to this y equals to x square minus 2x plus c. Instead of plus c, you now put the minus 30 there so that you now have exact equation or exact curve. So that exact curve is now going to be y equals to x square minus 2x minus 30. This is the curve that we asked to find. That is the equation of the curve. So let me just share with you the mark distribution for this very question as it is contained in the marking scheme. So the very first mark is method one mark when you now try to write the integral of 2 into x minus 1 with respect to x, you have this method one mark. When you now integrate it correctly and have x squared minus 2x plus c, you have this accuracy one mark. And when you now substitute the value of x as 4, the value of y as 5 in your curve y equals to x squared minus 2x plus c, in attempt to get to this c, you now have this method 1 mark. And when you now have the constant of integration exactly equals to minus 30, you have this accuracy 1 mark. And when you now write the equation exactly y equals to x squared minus 2x minus 30, you have this bonus 1 mark. So in total, this question has five good marks.